Surrounded by over 20 million people, the Pine Barrens is the largest undeveloped coastal area between Massachusetts and Virginia. Slightly larger in size than the state of Rhode Island, the New Jersey Pine Barrens occupies over one million acres in one of the most developed regions of the world. Today, at nearly half its original size, the Pine Barrens occupies the southern coastal plain of New Jersey. The remarkable geology of this region has created a place that is unique on Earth, a place on which its human inhabitants are vitally dependent for water, clean air, and open space. Broom Crowberry offers a glimpse into the geology of this landscape. This unassuming plant grows throughout the sandy plains. It's a disjunct species, meaning it grows here in the Pine Barrens and is not found again until the northern realms of Maine and Labrador. Broom Crowberry most likely arrived as the last ice age was waning 12,000 years ago. The northern part of New Jersey was buried under the Wisconsin ice sheet. The ice sheet was part of a vast glacier extending from Canada down to the northeast. It was the most recent ice age capping off eons of freezing and warming that repeatedly submerged New Jersey beneath the ocean. This cycle of flooding deposited layer upon layer of sand and clay hundreds of feet deep. Today, the flat terrain gives few clues to this dramatic past. The Pine Barrens is not really barren at all. The name came from early European settlers who had little success cultivating traditional row crops in the acidic, nutrient-poor soils. But this landscape of sand and flowing water has created plant and animal communities elegantly adapted to this extraordinary environment. Today, the upland reaches of the Pine Barrens are populated by nearly endless stands of pitch pines, heaths, and oaks. This vast wilderness enticed European settlers to harvest timber for firewood, charcoal, and building materials. The entire Pine Barrens region has most likely been harvested many times. Native plants revived and flourished as industries moved west, leaving the Pine Barrens to recover. The pitch pine thrives here because it has developed adaptations to survive in these nutrient-poor soils.